Former hostage Jerry Plotkin describes near tears his feelings when he learned of the failed hostage rescue attempt. While another Southland hostage, Gary Lee, fulfills a promise to say a prayer of thanksgiving at his father's church in Pasadena. The Screen Actors Guild takes its first concrete step toward a possible merger with AFTRA, and Orange County faces the possibility of a bus strike that could leave thousands of riders stranded. Also tonight, hundreds of protesters speak out against the new wave of anti-Semitism in Southern California. If I take some Heinz ketchup and put it in a kitchen strainer and do the same with the other national brands, something amazing happens. See the difference? How about this? Yep, we challenged the competition and they ran. Heinz ketchup is thicker and Heinz really pours on the flavor. Now, which one would you rather have on your hamburger? Thick, rich Heinz. You never run out of great taste. Introducing the four-door sedan that performs like a stunt car. The newly styled Datsun 310. The sure-footed cornering of front-wheel drive and a 1.5-liter engine to pull you through. Inside flush buckets, optional power steering, full instrumentation. Datsun's new 310. Front-wheel drive that pulls a lot of miles out of every gallon. Drive a Datsun the Burger King What's My Specialty quiz game. Sorry to disappoint you. Why, uh, Marshall? Sorry. Do you win? I win? Lindbergh, pilot. Sorry. I lose. You win. I win? Correct answers for the Coke, fries, or specialty sandwiches. Save up winning cards for biggest prizes. Remember, if you expect to lose, sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. You win. You won. I win? I won. Play What's My Specialty. I won. Burger King. Eyewitness News, the latest update from the Southland's number one news team. This is Channel 7, the number one station for news and information in Southern California. And our latest breaking Eyewitness News with Barry Carroll, Lisa Speck, Tony Hernandez, Fred Arnold with sports, Johnny Mountain with the weather, and the Eyewitness News team. Good evening, here's what's happening. Former hostage Gary Lee vowed that he would attend no religious services until he could first go to his father's church in Pasadena. Tonight, he got his wish. Henry Alfaro was there. 